Hey everybody, I'm I'm here with a special guest named Eddie. Uh, hi Eddie, how you doing, buddy? So, I one of the cans products that we carry is a 95% uh, meat, and I think this is my favorite out of out of. Uh, oh, we got guests. We got a whole bunch of guests here. I think this is my favorite out of all the all the cans that we carry because, unfortunately, many many dogs are overweight. So how do you get your dog to lose weight? The first thing is you cut back on the dry food and you add some all meat can. You don't add can, any kind of canned food because most canned foods have some sort of starches. They have potato, they have rice, they have some sort of starch. Our 95% is nothing but basically meat stuffed in a can. We have a turkey, a chicken, and a beef. So the deal is, it's Atkins or South Beach, folks. You cut down on the amount of carbs, because all dry food, no matter what kind, has to have some carbs, and you feed more protein, right? And there's virtually no carbs in this. So all it is is meat, water, uh, the guar gum, which, which uh, sounds like uh, chewing gum, but it isn't. It's what binds the, the food, and vitamins and minerals. So we have Eddie here. I want to give a little, I want to show you what the food looks like. And we have a little, little uh, taste test here. So, oh, we got a bunch of tasters here to come over if every, anybody wants, but let's just see. So I want to show you what it looks like. It, it literally is chopped up. It just, it's like chicken that went through a, uh, a meat grinder, and that's all it is. So there's a couple ways that you can use this. The first way is you can feed this exclu exclusively because there is vitamins and minerals, so it's a complete and balanced diet. But the second way, which is the one I recommend to almost every dog, is cut back the amount of dry and put some of this in it, and it just smells like chicken. So, hey, Eddie, come here. You want to try some? Huh? So Eddie doesn't usually eat canned food, right? Eddie's, no. uh, Eddie's a dry food, yeah. uh, and I don't want to give him too much because he's, uh, he's going to uh, suck that whole thing right up. My wife does cook chicken. She cooks chicken? Well, guess what? She doesn't have to cook chicken anymore. So Eddie, can I take this? Uh, you got a little treat. You want to lick off the the fork, huh? I think I think it passed the taste test. So all kidding aside, now folks, here's the serious. Uh, so anyway, again, here's what, here's the serious part of this food. If your dog has diabetes, and there's a lot of dogs that do have diabetes, the Dave's 95 is the food that you should feed because there are virtually no carbs. So you obviously know how diabetes works sugar and carbs, or carbs turns to sugar, spikes the blood sugar. I'm certain that if you talk to your veterinarian, your veterinarian will vouch for what I'm, I'm saying. So the Dave's 95, it's very reasonably priced. It's made here, uh, right here in the U.S., uh, some, uh, let's say it's in, in Chicago, and it is the best food, I'm not gonna say in the world, but it's a great food if your dog has diabetes, if your dog is overweight, and Let's say that you have an older dog and uh, his teeth are gone or her teeth are gone um, and you didn't go for the dental implants and you want a nice soft food but you still want the dog to get all the nourishment it needs, the Dave's 95 is the perfect food for it. Again, there is vitamins and minerals in here. There are other 95 diets on the market but they don't have the vitamins and minerals which means they're not a complete and balanced diet. That's why this is so important. So. Uh, thank you very much for watching this. Say goodbye, Eddie. Eddie's looking at some other dogs down, down the aisle. Thanks for watching, folks.